how to convert AVIF to JPEG or PNG and other image file types. As you can see on my desktop, I have an image called Thumbnail. This image has an AVIF image file type. And in today's video, we're going to be converting it to another image file type, such as PNG. But before we start the conversion process, I want to first show you that this indeed is an AVIF image file. So all I'm going to do is right click on this image and then left click on show more options. Once done, I'm going to left click on properties to be greeted with the images properties. In the general tab, we can see the type of file is AVIF file or .AVIF. Once you've located your AVIF image, open up your browser and navigate to the following URL address, https colon slash slash cloudconvert.com slash AVIF dash two Dash JPEG. Once you're here, you'll be on the Cloud Convert AVIF to JPG converter. As you can see, it's currently set to convert AVIF to JPG. If you want to convert AVIF, for example, to another file type, left click on this arrow next to JPG, and then you'll be able to see other image file types such as BMP, EPS, GIF or GIF, ICO, JPG, ODD, PNG, PS, PSD, TIFF and WebP or WEBP. Currently, we're set to convert AVIF to JPG. I want to change this to PNG. And now if we look at the conversion file types, it says AVIF to PNG. And at the very top in the address bar, the URL link changes a bit. It now says slash AVIF dash two dash PNG. Once you've selected the file type that you're going to be converting AVIF to, you'll need to select your file for conversion. To do this, simply left click on select file. Once you've done that, you'll be greeted with a window to select your AVIF file. Locate your AVIF file. Mine is on my desktop. So I'm going to click on desktop here on the left hand side. And then I'm going to look for my AVIF file. And there it is right here. It's called thumbnail. All I'm going to do now is left click on it to select it and then left click on open to select it for conversion. And now as you can see, our thumbnail.avif image has been added to Cloud Convert for conversion. It will be converted to PNG. And if you want further options to adjust your image conversion, you can left click on this wrench icon for your images to see further options. As you can see, you can adjust the following parameters, width, height of the image that you're going to convert to, the fit, which is currently set at max. You can also strip the metadata such as XIF data if you want. Currently it's set to no, you can change this to yes if you want. Under fit, you can get an explanation what exactly this means. And lastly, at the very bottom is quality. You can see the quality by default is set at 75. You can change this if you want. I'm going to leave it as it is. And then all I'm going to do is left click on okay. Once you've made your adjustments, now you're ready for the conversion process. To convert your AVIF file, all you need to do is left click on convert. Your image will then be successfully converted and you'll be greeted with a window displaying a preview of your converted image. So as you can see at the very top, you can see our file name with our new .png extension. We have our image preview here and at the very bottom on the right hand side, you have two options to close or to download. Of course guys, we want to download this PNG image. So just simply left click on download. Your converted image will then be downloaded. All I'm going to do now is navigate to the bottom left hand corner of my browser to our downloaded image and left click on this arrow next to its name and then left click on show in folder to be taken right to the download location of our converted image. Let's check if our image can be opened. So all I'm going to do is double click on our newly converted image. And as you can see, it's fully functioning. So I'm just going to close out of the image now. And now to check if our image has been successfully converted from AVIF to PNG, all I'm going to do is right click on our converted image, left click on show more options, and then left click on properties. And once done, you'll be taken to your images properties where under type of file, you can see it now says PNG file .png, which means our image file conversion from AVIF to PNG was successful. And that pretty much concludes the video on how to convert AVIF to JPG or PNG and other image file types. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Why is it so